Former Kenyan president and East African community peace envoy Uhuru Kenyatta said in a communique that he talked to a Rwandan president, Paul Kagame, and that the two men agreed that it's very important for the East African force deployed in eastern DRC to immediately take over uh, territories that have recently been captured by M23. Um, they also say that it's very important for this force to ensure peace, stability and security for civilians. And according to the communique, uh, Rwandan president Paul Kagame agreed to urge the M23 to cease fire and withdraw from these areas. But it's unclear what's going to happen now. I was uh, with the Kenyan troops deployed in eastern DRC two days ago, and their orders are clear. Their main goal is not to fight. It's more to help the Congolese army to demobilize uh, M23 uh, fighters. But it's unclear if they're going to fight to capture the towns or if they will wait for a ceasefire. But this communique is very important ahead of the Rwanda 2 summit, which will happen next week. You know that the tensions are high between Rwanda and the DRC. Felix Chisekedi uh, accuses his Rwandan counterpart to support the M23. And this summit will bring together both uh, Congolese and Rwandan leaders. And their goal is clear, to create a path uh, to stability through a ceasefire in eastern DRC.